the author of the passage is primarily concerned with what? So you've read the passage and now you can break it down in your own words without looking at the answers, because if you look at the answers, you're likely to be swayed in a different direction. So the passage is saying that, hey, look at these plants, look at these flora on Hawaii. How did they get there? They didn't grow here indigenously. indigenously. They must have come from elsewhere. That is, the seeds came from a different place that had a similar climate. How did they get there? Well, and then, of course, they go out and they try a few theories. They say maybe the birds brought them and how did the birds bring them, etc. So this passage then is concerned with offering a few theories on how the flora or how seeds got to Hawaii. That's my own answer. Then I mash that up with answer choice B, discussing different theories about the transport of plant seeds to Hawaii, which is very close to what I actually said. And that's why it's so important to come up with the answer in your own words. Now, if you notice D and E, resolving a dispute, there is no dispute, dispute resolved here at any point in time. There are only theories. This theory is the more likely one. The birds bringing the seeds in their belly or on their feathers. But it never resolves it, the dispute for sure. So therefore, D and E, neither of those are correct. And again, the answer is B.